at the beginning stage of a relationship, every man is expected to take the first step when it comes to a woman. They're expected to show interest and get their phone number, and that's perfectly normal. So you want to make sure you're taking that first step. Show the girl that you're interested and that you want to take it to somewhere where you know you get to know each other. That's all you want to do at first. You don't want to appear as, hey, let's be boyfriend or girlfriend. No, <laughs> don't do that. So at the beginning stage, I want to stress that this is the beginning stage of a relationship. You want to get to know her because remember, you have to ask yourself if you want to take this to another level. You should do that. You shouldn't just have her doing that. You should do that for yourself because if you're not interested, move on. Be okay with that. Now, at the beginning stage of a relationship, you want to test the waters. You want to see if she's going to show any interest, if she wants to do anything else besides just a simple text message. Just see where it goes and gauge the conversation and let it just grow organically. Let the relationship grow at a slow pace, right? And what happens is if you take your time, things are going to move forward, but just don't move too fast. You got to strike a delicate balance between showing interest, pursuing, and not appearing desperate. If you appear desperate, you're done. You're finished, right? Now, also remember the 30% rule. The 30% rule says 30% of people will love you, 30% will like you, and 30% of people will be indifferent to you. So if she's indifferent to you, well, you got to make sure that you really, you know, move slow because she's not going to give anything away. She's trying to get to know you. And that's what women like to do. They don't like to just, you know, throw their feelings that they're not going to do that. They're going to take their time with you. So take your time, do yourself a solid and just move at a good pace. Now, at some point, she'll go cold on you. She'll just disappear. And you're like, what did I do? And what men tend to do is they they think they got to fix it. So they reach out more. They call, they text. They try to figure out what they're up to. And what happens is the woman pulls away. She just loses interest and you don't hear from her ever again. So here's what you want to do. If she pulls away, which she likely will, do nothing. Go live your life. Go focus on your purpose. Go do what you got to do and get better. And I guarantee she'll reach out. She'll be like, I haven't heard from such and such in so long. Why haven't I heard anything? And then sure, reach out. What you want to do is you want her to keep reaching out, initiating conversations, initiating more phone calls than you. And eventually you both get to know each other and she starts setting up dates with you. And if she does that, let her do that. Let her keep setting up times to meet up because you want to build that attraction her in her. So she'll keep coming to you. And it's a beautiful setup because now she is showing interest and then you can invest, right? And it's a perfect balance. She's chasing, you're pursuing, and nobody is appearing desperate. And that's what you want to accomplish. You don't want to come across as desperate. You have things going on. And remember, think of it like a house. You're building the foundation. The foundation is the most important piece. So build it correctly. Do it in an organic way. Take your time. Remember, you're trying to build her attraction. You're not trying to move too fast. So don't talk about kids, marriage, or boyfriend, girlfriend. Don't do any of that. Just be cool, be calm, and be confident. And as long as you do those things, you will draw her to you. You'll be able to strike that nice balance between pursuing her, showing interest, and not appearing desperate. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to know why you should never chase a woman, go check that video out now, and I'll see you in the next one.